Hey everybody, the Banga's back. We're gonna part 52 of Let's Play Xenogears. Alright, it's time for us to uh, head over to Solaris now, but we gotta see the Queen first. That way we can let everyone know that, hey, we're ready to go. And regardless of what team you're with, either way you're going in there with C10 and Ellie. Which works for me. Are you prepped and ready? I made a backup save, like, over here in Shabbat in case things go wrong. So, I think we should be good. Let's go. Good. Then we are off. We are depending on you, Maria. Please transport us to Solaris on the side's end. Yes! Side's end is ready to go anytime! I admire the spirit, Maria. <laughs> Let's go. In fact, that, that could have been my opportunity to just go out and teach Emeralda death blows or whatever. But we'll worry about that later. Simpson, let's go! Like, I don't think there's any massive urgency to get Emeralda her death blows. That is, if, depending on how many she has at the time. So I guess we'll just continue as is. Ooh, that, that thing's kind of dangerous. Hope you don't fall off. I'm coming, Solaris. Samson and I shall be the dark wings which carry you all to your deaths. Can you wait till we actually, like, enter and then leave, and then you do the thing? I don't want you to kill us, alright? <laughs> this is a barrier! Please, Saibzen! A grab field is opening! The space distortion correction is starting! Oh, we're pushing in! We did it! Alright, we're in. I don't like that we're upside down, though. It's dangerous to move in a big group. We'll take separate routes. Right. Don't worry. I'm good at gathering info. Whoa, what are you doing here? You just like to watch others' misery. You'll just get in the way. Forgive me. Sorry. Maria! Yes, what is it? The disorder Sibes and caused when breaking the gate has almost cleared up. You and everyone else must sleep before the enemy detection system activates again. We will take care of the rest. Okay. Be careful. Seems like the world's upside down. It's creepy. Solaris gravity is the opposite that of the land. We don't have time to explain. You'll get used to it. It's uncomfortable for us on the surface at first. Hey, what's this? It looks like some kind of storage or distribution center. I'm not sure, but... It's probably used to ship off extra supplies, materials, and fuel gathered from the surface. These are the technology and products you land dwellers receive from the ethos. For now, shall we gather some information? Yes, I'd like for us to get moving. I see a tube. Is this a container from the transport system Ellie was talking about? Well, I'm not sure, but I think I've seen this before. Shall we take a look? What are you saying? We don't have time for that. We have to get out of here quickly. Didn't you say we had to gather information? We could probably sneak in using this thing. 
What? Hey! God, he's like a kid sometimes. Wait, do I see a memory cube in there? It's very zoomed out, but I see what see it. Oh, 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 okay, it's rotating. Oh, thank goodness for that. Where am I now? Well, wherever we are, we should definitely save. Remember, I got a backup save left in Shabbat in case we kind of book ourselves into a corner. And so, let's just go ahead and keep one save there, like right here. And then we'll just use this one. And we could probably just have access to both of them again once we're free. Oh, well at least there's an exit in this tube. Look at all these triangles. At least I don't have to leap off onto any of them. No! Can't handle it anymore! Something's wrong with all of you! Working like machines day after day! You have no will! This isn't living! This is... is... Stop it! Let go! I just picked him up on like nothing. He's like, you're out of place, get back to work. <laughs> Wow. That is some harshness. Huh. I want to move up a rank to second class citizen. Then I can finally live with a second class. Hello. You got no business at the watchtower? Beat it! Return to 1236? Is that what it says? We'll try the elevator, see what happens. Hello. Why look like Guile is like brown hair? T Timothy? Unfortunately, I'm not Timothy. The name's Samson. But hey, I know you. How do you know me? Who are you? From the tournament. Unfortunately, I lost in the first round. I passed out on the way home. And. When I came to, I found myself here. Everyone else got them what they call rearranged. It's a cross between brainwashing and amnesia. But they messed up on me, and I can still remember. Then what about that last person? Yep, him too. Died in vain. One of my few friends, too. I'm not going out like that. You know that guard tower near us? I'm gonna go through it past the second class block. Sneak into the naval port and kiss Solaris goodbye. Can you do that? Yeah, so I got a pass. They got me working at the naval port. I'm only supposed to leave when it's my shift, but I saw that little snag. Hey, why don't you come along? With your power, we'll be set. Uh, sure, I wouldn't want to be in a place like this. Right, that's the spirit. But be careful. A female gabbler just came by for some reason. Did she have auburn hair? Yeah, that's her. What, your friends? Kind of thing of it, she was looking for someone. She still ought to be around here somewhere. You ought to look for her. Alright, well, I'll just leave you be now, Samson. Word of advice, don't cut your hair. I guess I can't really go that way. What about this elevator? Hey, get on the elevator, please. 1111? We'll, we'll try that one next. I wonder which cell I was in. Hope I'm not going in circles. 
Don't rabble rouse here. Just work, eat, and sleep. Just keep doing that and you'll live. If anyone complains, our entire unit will be punished too. Which means we all get rearranged. You'll never come back. God, that, that seems like some kind of hellscape. Like, you just have to, you're only here to eat, sleep, work, and this is all you do for the rest of your life? God, that's, that's awful. And you do this until you die. It's messed up. K-Block, they're all being rearranged. Poor guys. And they work so hard, too. Even if we think so, that doesn't mean the administration does. 10 4 1. Alright, I'll try that one next. Well, Samson told me that Ellie was looking for me. Oh, there you are! Faye? Ellie! Faye? You're so careless! If you're trying to infiltrate the base, you have to be subtle! Sorry. Well,. Where are we? We're in the Solaris 3rd Class F Block. There's around 20 blocks each with land dwellers living in them. We Solarians are privy to all personal info. Everyone's DNA structure is inscribed on a molecular level. And even their class. You know what these citizens are called? 3rd Class? No. Worker bees. It came from the shape of their housing blocks. These people provide the manual labor vital to the support of Solaris' core. I took a field trip here once long ago. I remember thinking that their lives had nothing to do with me. I never thought it would end up here like this. Which means you should know your way around here, Ellie. Vaguely. We need to escape first. Oh yeah. Where's Doc? He took a different pod looking for you. He may have ended up in a different block. Damn, we're all spread out. I wouldn't worry about C-10. He knows this city better than I do. I wonder if Bart and them made it okay. Jesse's with them, so they should be fine. I hope so. Anyway, let's move on. Alright, so I guess we'll just go. We'll see if Samson worked out a plan to escape. So if I remember correctly, he's beyond that elevator and at this one. Let's see if I recognize the number. Oh my god. 1236. Yes, that's the one. Look, these people are pretty much warehoused. It's messed up. So, she was on our side after all. Here, take this. What is it? A second-class citizen work permit, just like mine. With that, you can move about more freely without arousing suspicion. Well, she's with you. There shouldn't be any problems. Well, I'll be at the tower entrance. Alright, well, I guess we'll have to look for you outside. I don't think that's the tower entrance over there next to the guard. Maybe here? This is a dust chute. Third class citizens have nothing to do with this. Go back where you came from. Yeah, but well, that's fine, because I actually have a work permit now. Wow, this place is so large. I guess I can't actually access the dust chute, can I? Yeah, because I can't leap up there. Oh, oh, why am I going that way? That's a dead end. Uh, let's see. Samson, where are you? Like, I don't even know where he is. This one? Hey! It's me! Me! Ready to go? Wait, did Samson wear, like, a disguise? From here on, it'll be better if we split up. It's a maze, so be careful. 
Yeah, you too. Are we really going to be okay? Well, only one way to find out. <laughs> Okay, that door doesn't work. What about this way? There's two elevators. Let's see what this one leads to first. Let's take care of this and move on. Care of what exactly? I don't think those lights do anything. I wonder if those things actually like uh, push you back. Get these. Ah! What are you doing? You are ordered to withdraw. Seemed like the right idea at the time. It was not. All right, so I guess we gotta try that path again. Only this time, I should have stayed in the one hallway I was in, rather than cross over. Me crossing over was not a good idea. So apparently it could see me even from behind. That is messed up. Which in that case, let me just stick around this way. Is it gonna turn around? It is gonna turn around. Okay, just in case, I'm gonna have to wait for it to go all the way. I don't know how far its vision is. Okay, we're, we're good, we're good. Uh, another elevator? Okay, let's go to this one. I don't hear another patrol. There's another elevator. I guess we can find out where it leads. It's a dead end. Oh, wait a minute! There's a treasure here! Aquasol Deluxe. And that's all we came for. Hey, Ellie, get in the elevator, please. Thank you. That almost gave me a panic attack thinking we glitched. Hey, you made it. Not bad. Yeah, we only got caught once. I think I'll let myself go on ahead. Wait. You're not a gazelle. What are you going to do? Not a problem. I use underground tech to rewrite my ID. ID error eliminate. Samson! Oh, wait, wait, oh, oh! Whoa! Damn, he got wrecked. I guess he's Ash now. Damn you! I'm gonna destroy it. No! What? It's useless to do that! You won't be able to get through without either a first-class citizen ID or a military ID. Then what are we gonna do? Wait, you're in the military? Well, we can't just stand here. I guess it's gonna have to be all or nothing. If it doesn't work out, we'll worry about it later. Is what you're saying? Isn't that kind of sounding like Bart? How rude! It's not like I always go in without a plan. First class citizen, Gazel confirmed. Please pass through in an orderly fashion. We can get through. Or is it just you? What's wrong? Huh? Oh, well, I've done so much. I'm surprised they haven't labeled me as a traitor yet. You think it's because they haven't reported it? To the Gabler, it would be like admitting failure and all. I hope so. Anyway, let's go. Okay. Oh, stay very close to me. That way I shouldn't pick up your presence. 
Yeah, uh, Ellie was actually, uh, two lots of DNA, so it's all good. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Now we're over here? Not a scanner. Why did I have to take two scanners? Hey! Why are you coming out of there? Come over here! I'm an Imperial Special Forces Lieutenant, Ellie Van Houten. I have just completed the collection of the Special Levy of the third class level. I am now in the process of taking this surface dweller back to HQ. Any problems with that? Gebler? No, no problems. Please, go on. That's what I thought. The one behind you, is the Gebler? I heard the lamps destroyed the gate. Is everything okay? Yeah, it's fine. Phew, what a relief. Yeah, three gates got destroyed. It's no big deal. You got a lot of guts going into an area full of those barbarians. Yes, yes. Oh, there's a mistake here. Please try it one more time. Again, this is why I hate government offices. Wow. Only a gambler could do that. Hello. Can I, I can't talk to you guys? Really? Um. I guess there's only one way to go, and that's through here. Two lots of doors? For real? <laughs> but how's that with the music? As a service to citizens, we are now accepting data for the marriage service. Alright, Ellie, we got work to do. The Central Control Bureau will pick the very best match for you. Our motto is good matches make good descendants. <laughs> we are the seed that came from it, so of course we are the best. <laughs> Solaris probably had like uh, issues with her budget, so now they do their matchmaking through plenty of fish. <laughs> you look rather odd. Third class citizens should dress more appropriate. Then maybe you shouldn't be a hurdle! Ha! So who's the loser now? What do you think of these pogo shoes? They were made for the newest technology. They don't put stress on your spine. They're the best! The Imperial model is a super cool, ultra rare item. Uh, okay. What, did I just walk through a gate? Okay. I thought that was just an actual solid door. Which one? Which... What? Whoa! Hold up a minute! Ooh, we can get some really good stuff! I really should get a matchlock for Billy. Yeah, we'll give him a little souvenir. Uh, you know what? We're, we should get some of these. Some of that. Actually, two of that. Two lots of shot G70 ammo. I don't know about, like, the, uh... What, this is for matchlock ammo. Maybe one of each. We don't want... We're gonna be a little bit too concerned about, like, losing out on money and stuff. Uh, do I want another feather cap? I should get another feather cap. Yeah, let's get two of each. It's like we're just buying it for our kid. Oh, oh, Billy, he loves his guns. Let's just get him something nice, huh? Sure thing! We'll get him the extra ammo, too, because we're good parents. Alright, so let's go with the Crimson Vest, and where's the, uh... Feather... Oh, wait, 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 I passed it. Feather cap, there we go. Alright, does this replace the Devil Dress? Because we got that from a dragon. Oh, it does? Okay, that works. Wait a minute! Didn't I have, like, some kind of mermaid mail or whatever? Oh, it's actually worse than the Crimson Vest. Oh, in that case, now, never mind. <laughs> Feather Cap is better than what we have, alright. You know what I haven't done in a long time? Cell equipment. Choose party member. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. I don't want to do that. 
Okay, the red mail kind of sucks, as does the leather vest. Uh, metal vest can go. Ether Veiler will keep. Wedding dress we should keep, because at least it's unique. And this stuff right here. Metal jackets are kind of crap, so I'll get rid of them. The night mail is crap. Penguin coats are crap. Alright, so we'll, we'll do a deal with that for now. I'm just got some money. Wait a minute, is my laundry done already? Nah, it can't be. I actually have some laundry going on while I'm recording this episode. I'll, I'll keep this going for now until I find the next save point. Oh, no pogo shoes for you. Poor kid. Which one? Oh, I'm one of the pogo shoes too. I guess I'll have to settle for Omega Sol that just keeps me from dying. Fine. At least that's a nice alternative to pogo shoes. This is the Ticketmeister. What are you looking for? Um, buy and sell? We're giving out dedication tickets. Please come to room 21 in Atrin Court. Uh, tickets? VIP seating for the dedication is all sold out. Please enjoy it on home vision. Home vision? Isn't that like, just a word for TV? Uh, okay. That was weird. Let's just get a good look around at this place. Who the hell are you? Here's our special seats for the dedication. Huh? No ticket? You can't go in. Dedication ceremony! Solaris is probably not doing so well now. Well, they lost a good lieutenant. Huh? Why do we have to watch this? We decided to meet everyone. We don't have time to go to this festival. This is no ordinary festival. The people are disturbed by the gate's disappearance. The dedication is probably to quell the masses. Oh, it's just, you know, brainwashing. We must check Solaris' stance against land dwellers. Faye, we need to get tickets. Yeah? I guess we have to get some info on the enemy, but they're sold out. We can't get tickets. Hurry up. There's not much time until the dedication. It's a JRPG. We have as much time as we need. Because time doesn't pass until we do stuff. Alright, what is this place? Wow, this is sterile as all hell. At least you can tell if there's a mess. The staining would definitely show up. What? That can't be Big Joe, is it? One, two, one, two. I'm practicing dancing, don't bug me. One, two, one, two. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. What? I guess I can't talk to this guy. Alright, well, you go make yourselves dizzy. Don't blame me if you start vomiting. This must be some kind of apartment complex. Why does that look like Tifa with, like, some extra armor? Well, I mean, this is a Square game, after all. I wanted a DK-1200 doll! Well, I'm sorry, but that's, you know, the, uh, property of Rare now. I want real plants! You can't buy real plants unless you're a first-class citizen. Oh, I'm so jealous. That's probably the first time I've even seen real plants. <laughs> I bet you these guys don't even get real food. Let's see what's up on the second floor. Even Solaris Advanced Science can't halt aging. They say the powerful have overcome it. They already have great descendants. What more do they want? Don't you agree? I'm gonna talk to someone else. I came to see the Emperor and strain my back. They can cure almost anything but a bad back. Yeah. Oh, you got cancer? Sure, 20 bucks. Bad back? Uh, That's beyond our skill. And after putting up with all that to get tickets. Oh, what? What did you do to get the tickets? 
I feel like you're not telling me everything as to how you got this bad bag. Hey, you kids. Need tickets to go to the dedication? Yeah. Kids like you really should see it. Well, we couldn't buy them, so there you go. Forget the money. Just hurry or you'll miss it. I'm gonna watch it on home vision. Oh, uh, well, that solved that problem. We got the tickets. I wonder what's in the other apartment. Okay, how the hell did you get a memory cube? Go and save on that memory cube. You can rest easy if you send your data to the Central Control Bureau regularly. I've heard they're lying around on the ground in places for data collecting. So, wow, that's a great way to break the fourth wall. Good for you, I guess. How does Ellie not even have 400 HP at level 59? You're level 59, for Christ's sake! How the hell do you not have 400 HP? I thought, like, if you're, like, level 60, in most JRPGs, that's considered over-leveled. Here, it's just like, uh, you're kind of pushing it. Anyway, I think we should, uh, end the episode here, and then the next part, we're gonna go to the dedication. Hope we got some good seats. See everyone, thanks for watching.